Hey everybody, it's Chris. Welcome to the Blue Collar Beer Gourmet channel. This is part eight in the beer glassware series, part of the Blue Collar Gentleman series. Uh, today I'm going to be discussing a, a rather unique glass. As soon as I can find it, there it is. This is the Stange. You will notice it is tall and slender. This glass is 6.75 ounces. Now you might be wondering what's the deal with this glass? Well, Stange is the German word for stick. As you can see, this quite resembles a stick. In fact, upon first inspection, you might assume that this was perhaps a, uh, a vase for uh, a delicate flower. But instead, this is a glass for delicate beers. Now, uh, this particular glass, this particular style, uh, amplifies hop and aroma nuances in delicate beers. It's better for enjoying fragile taste and aroma in a beer. It's better for quick drinking. Um, it, last but not least, okay, so if apparently during Oktoberfest, <clears throat> these come out in a, in a device known as a Kranz. A Kranz carries several of these. And what these will usually be filled with is, um, some kind of light beer. Uh, well, the, the varieties that you, that are specifically, uh, that you're supposed to drink out of this are Alt Beer, Kolsch, and American Gozes. American Goza specifically, because remember, your Leipzig Goza, you drink out of a Pilsner glass, and your Belgian Goza, you drink out of a Belgian or Tulip glass. So the Stange here is for, uh, as I said, Kolsch's, American Goza's, alt beers. I've also read a couple of places, a couple of websites claim that any fruit beer at all, any fruit beer in the least, so if it's a blueberry Hefeweizen, or if it's a raspberry IPA, or if it's a, um, if it's a banana stout, you can drink it out of a staunch. I don't know about all that. I, I tend to uh, stick to the variety when it comes to fruit beers as opposed to that, but I, you know, I, I can't argue that. I mean, if, if, if that's the case, um, fruits do end up making a beer a little bit more delicate. Uh, as I said, this is 6.75 ounces. Nancy picked this up for me off of Amazon, 10.95, no shipping. Um, but uh, as you can see, it's <coughs> well. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm not feeling so hot. I think I may have picked up a summer cold. Um, the deal with these is, if you don't have a stange, if you don't uh, have 10.95 to go out and buy a stange, if um, if your favorite glass blower refuses to make this for you. Use a Collins glass. Collins glass is tall and slender. It's going to carry, a Collins glass carries more than 6.75 ounces in most instances, I believe, although most Collins glasses are not quite as tall as this. Point being, it's tall and slender, and that's basically what you're looking for here. Stange being the German word for stick. So, if, uh, I, I've not, I've never been to a proper Oktoberfest, but apparently at a proper Oktoberfest, uh, like maybe as a refresher or you know, uh, a, a lighter one may, uh, at some point, a, a Kranz full of stanges comes out and you grab one off of there and you, boom, you, you drink it down quickly and you enjoy it for the nice, light, delicate beer that it is. And then you move on to the heavier stuff. So that's, that's apparently how a stange works. And that's what stanges are for. Alt beers, Kolsch's, and American Gozes. And, uh, that's really about all I have to say about the Stange. This is going to be a really quick video because there, there's not much more to say about it. It's kind of self-explanatory. It's it's tall, it's slender, it's a stick. And, and Stange is German for stick. Uh, so lest I repeat myself for the 18th time, I'm going to go ahead and end this video reminding you to uh, always try to drink beer out of a proper glass. And one more time because I want to include this. I'm going to try to include this in every video. And I don't think I have in, in the other videos. But if all else fails, pour your beer into a pint glass. Sometimes the brewer is going to tell you to drink this directly from the can. <laughs> if they do, then that's, if they, if that's what the brewer says, then by all means, drink it directly from the can. But unless specifically told otherwise, always pour your beer into a glass. If you don't have any other glass, use a pint glass. The, the Nonic, the, uh, the British pint glass, pour it into glass, pour it into a glass and enjoy it that way. But always try to use proper glassware whenever you have it. And as I said, if you don't feel like going out and buying one of these, pick up a Collins glass. Those, those you can find just about anywhere. Folks, I really appreciate you watching these videos, and I appreciate you liking, commenting, and subscribing. Don't forget to share it with somebody you think could use this. 
And remember, until next time, that part of the gentleman's code is constantly seeking self-improvement. Cheers.